Hi, welcome to Essential Wholesale and Labs Kitchen Chemistry. I'm Laura Badcock and this is my son Koopa. And today I am going to show you how you can work with your kid in the kitchen to convert a base product into something a little bit more. Glory, Stephen, and I were talking about how during the change of the season our hair gets a little dry and we all love the Herbal Alarenche Hair and Body Wash. So we talked about maybe adding some oils and probably a, a scent to the product. Well, Koopa overheard us and begged us if he could do it in the kitchen for us. We're going to be using the Herbal Aloe and Shea Hair and Body Wash, Certified Organic Jojoba Golden Oil, and Certified Organic Castor Oil. Koopa also requested that we scent with our new Lingonberry Natural Fragrance Oil. He just loves the scent, and frankly, so do we. Definitely put your child on a stool, a stable stool, so that they are above the product before you get started. What I did was I poured off a pound of the hair and body wash to make it easier. And now I have a pound of the product. I'm going to show Koopa how he can weigh out the rest of the ingredients that are going to go into the product. So now I am going to show Koopa how he can pre-weigh the ingredients that we're going to add to the uh, body wash. So Koopa, you're going to take a container and you're going to tear out the scale, which means you're going to have the scale not recognize the weight of the container. So press the tear button. The first thing I'm going to do is I had poured off the oils into smaller containers to make it easier for him to pour. And if you can pour that jojoba oil into this container until your readout says 0.2 pounds. And Koopa is a little bit of a perfectionist. It's okay if you don't get it right on the dot. Fantastic, Koopa. Good job. All right, and then we're going to take away that container put the other container on the scale and we're going to tear out that so that you don't see the weight of the container. Perfect. And Cooper is going to take the castor oil now and pour it until he sees 0.2. We're doing equal amounts of castor and jojoba. Then we are going to weigh out the lingonberry fragrance oil and we're going to put about half a percent into this product. You can either use a pipette or you can pour directly. Cooper, what would you like to do? You are only looking for a very, very small amount. So I would recommend the pipe. Pipette. Okay, and you want to do 60 drops. So 60. 60, you're going to squeeze the bulb of the pipette just a little bit, and you're going to count. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, now what Cooper is going to do is he's going to take these three different ingredients and add them to the shampoo. You're going to start out with uh, one of the oils, not the fragrance oil first. All of it? Pour all of it in. There goes the jojoba oil. Ah. Fantastic. Now we're going to take a high shear blender, like a hand mixer from your kitchen. And Cooper, it's right over there. And turn on your power button. And go ahead and hold it. Now move your wand up and down. Move your wand up and down to get the oil into the product. Good. That's exactly what you want to do. It might take a little bit of Okay. And Koopa, once you have uh, made sure everything has blended in well, you're going to add your fragrance oil. Oh, whoopsie. So, you probably want to help your child just to uh, stop any kind of spillage. Do you want me to do that for you? No. Okay. okay. Cooper says he's got it. Fabulous. All right. And you are going to mix one more time. Excellent stir. And here's what your finished product will look like. Nice and creamy. Uh, if you do find that your shampoo is a little too thin, you can always add sodium chloride or just your regular table salts at home if you'd like. Uh, it will work with this particular hair and body wash. It will not work uh, for a surfactant like decoglucoside, which is a non-ionic surfactant. But salt is a great thickener for other surfactants, uh, cationic and ionic. Enjoy. I'm looking forward to using this tonight. Thank you, Koopa. Mm -hmm.